Hey, Dina, the soccer team is practicing behind us tonight, getting ready for their big trip to Virginia tomorrow for their semifinals. And they're doing all of this under the leadership of a trailblazer. When Julianne Sitch was hired for this season, she became only the second woman to serve as a coach for one of the 415 teams in NCAA Division III men's soccer. She is now the first woman to lead a men's soccer team to the Final Four in any division. Sitch grew up in Oswego, Illinois. She went on to play soccer soccer at DePaul, then played as a professional internationally and here with the Chicago Red Stars. This is her first season as a coach at the University of Chicago, and she is making history. The Department of Education reports just 5% of NCAA coaches in men's sports are women. Sitch is hoping that changes soon, and she's leading the way. If you don't see it, you don't believe it, you don't dream it, you don't go after it, you don't aspire to be that. And so I think, you know, for myself, and. It, I, I'm hoping that, you know, things are continuing to move forward and change where women, young girls can see women in leadership roles, whether it's in the corporate world or sports world, gives them something to dream about, gives them something to believe in, and it gives them something to aspire to be. This team has been to the final four, four of the last five years, but they have never won a championship. So they're eager to get out there and perhaps make a little more history. We just talked to a player about the impact Coach Sitch has had here. We will have much more on her influence coming up tonight at 9. For now, we're live at the University of Chicago. I'm Jenna Barnes, mm. WGN News.